The Tennessee Volunteers are at odds of 15 to 1 to win the college football national championship. They are at odds of plus 450 to take the Southeastern Conference championship. Last season saw the Volunteers go 9 and 4 straight up while going 5 and 3 in the SEC. The team went 8 and 5 against the spread while going 7 and 6 on the over/under. Fourth-year head coach Butch Jones has slowly and methodically improved the Tennessee Volunteers every day with the goal of being able to seriously compete for the Southeastern Conference East Division title. And it appears that they have a serious shot at a breakout season. Tennessee has been in a long drought of mediocrity and disappointment with their last division title coming in 2007. The one thing that continues to elude Jones and the Volunteers is a marquee win over a power program. Jones has hauled in highly ranked recruiting classes and stocked up the talent and depth for long-term sustained success. Tennessee returns a whopping 18 starters this year and looks to be stocked for a deep run and a serious look at the SEC East Division title. The one dark cloud on the horizon is one of the toughest first half schedules in the land for the Tennessee Volunteers. Offensive coordinator Mike Dubord's debut season was a smashing success last year with the Volunteers climbing from 10th to 3rd for scoring offense in the SEC. Senior quarterback Joshua Dobbs is the trigger man for the improved attack. Dobbs completed 60% of his passes last year, good for 2,291 yards and a 15 to 5 touchdown to interception ratio, while adding 671 yards rushing and 11 touchdowns. While Dobbs still must polish up on his passing, his open field running ability forces defenses to stay honest. Junior running back Jalen Hurd will certainly do the same. Hurd ran for 1,285 yards and 4.6 yards per carry with 12 touchdowns last year. The offensive line returns four starters led by Deshaun Robertson. Senior right guard Dylan Weissman is in all SEC material. The defense also showed vast improvement with the final ranking of 16th in the nation for points allowed. The defense will have a new coordinator in Bob Shoup who inherits plenty of talent. Shoup will be charged with getting the defense to finish and hold off late rallies such as the ones by Oklahoma and Alabama last season. There are standouts throughout the lineup such as junior defensive end Derek Barnett. Senior linebacker Jalen reeves Maven is a preseason choice for all SEC honors. Cameron Sutton is a senior cornerback that is also all SEC material. Tennessee has been a solid betting value at home recently with nine payouts in their last 14 games. But the road has been a tougher challenge for Tennessee as the Volunteers have covered just seven out of their last 15 road games. Tennessee is a trendy and popular betting choice to post double digit win season and win the SEC East Division. The SEC East looks very winnable this year with Florida and Georgia going through a lot of transition. Upstart Missouri blew its program up last year and South Carolina has faded away as a serious contender. Tennessee will know by October 15th whether or not they are for real as the first half of their schedule is a brutal gauntlet and reality check. Jones has done an admirable job of building up the Tennessee program, but it's only his fourth season on the job and there may not be enough depth to successfully survive such a brutal schedule. Tennessee will be better this year, but they will be challenged to equal last year's 9-4 record. A breakout season can be had, but we'll wait to see how they handle the grueling first part of the season to make our bets. Join us at BetDSI.com for the best Tennessee Volunteers betting options, including futures, props, and live in-progress betting during the games.